Finney Smith to inbound. Back to Doncic. Doncic pulls up, three pointer. Bang! Bang! It's good! Doncic wins the game at the buzzer! Let's go! Luka Doncic! Boom! Shaka Luka! Fifty five hundred, nigga, that's your reign. When I go to the club, make it storm hurricane. Yeah. Nigga, pull up, think GI Joe, man. Seven six two, turn him GI Joe. Yeah. That Rico and Boo, baby, knee high, man. Now when I look down, you know I can't see my ankle. Now she F with some rats, gave her three times ten. Put her right in the condo, put her in the bin. And I did all of that, no one see her again. And honestly, on the better things, that's a freak. So before the video starts, man, I would just like to say uh, that it would be really, really appreciated if y'all go follow my Twitch. My Twitch is comp underscore snagger, as y'all see on the screen. Uh, we are on the road to uh, 300 followers. We're trying to hit 500 followers pretty damn soon. I stream every uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and once during the week, depending on uh, how my school schedule works. Uh, so it would be really, really, really appreciated if y'all go follow that, man. Uh, also, before the video starts, I know that a lot of people have been making Luka Doncic builds with um, with all the hype that he's gotten after his last game. Uh, so it isn't really the most original video idea. I mean, I've had this video idea since about Saturday. So since uh, after game three, I believe, or game four. Um, but uh, yeah, I've had this video for uh, idea for quite a while, man. I haven't copied any other builds. Uh, so if my builds look a lot like another build, I haven't copied it. It's just pure, um, it's just a pure coincidence. So without further ado, man, I hope you all enjoy the video. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Comp Snagger. 2K21, Comp Snagger, man, back with another video. And today we're doing it live on Twitch. Uh, first and foremost, I just want to tell y'all I'm sorry about the quality. I know the quality might not be the best. Uh, this is a um, screen recording off my live stream, so basically I'm just taking uh, my past broadcast and just screen recording it on my phone and editing it a little bit after. Uh, and because um, I don't have the greatest laptop, I can't stream with the highest frame rates and resolution, uh, so I have to settle for this gameplay. But since it's a my player builder, I think that it shouldn't matter too much. Uh, but today we are doing the Luka Doncic build, man. We are doing the Luka Doncic build, and as y'all know, Luka Doncic has been tearing it up in the NBA. He's been tearing it up, man. Really, really been tearing it up. The other night, he had 43, 17, and 13 against the Clippers without Porzingis and with a sprained ankle. I mean, the kid is just phenomenal. Uh, in my opinion, he's a top three or top five player in the NBA right now. Probably more top five because, you know... There's KD that's been injured that we're kind of forgetting about. There's Curry that's been injured that we're kind of forgetting about. But it's still probably like Dame, LeBron, KD, uh, and a couple other dudes. Uh, but yeah, man, he's creeping into that top five. Giannis, Harden, kind of forgetting those boys. So, uh, so you know. Uh, but he, he he's getting there, man. I definitely think that he's the future of the NBA. I think he might even be better than LeBron and Jordan were at the same age. So what we're going to start with is we're just going to make, you know, take his name Luka Doncic point guard because um, that is in my opinion the position that he plays he is the dominant ball handler in the Dallas Mavericks offense so I guess that you know we could just make him a point guard right-handed and his number is 77 but that's what you guys already know so basically continue uh, there's two pie charts that I was thinking about going with um, chat but uh, I think I'm gonna settle with the pure yellow the pure yellow so the pure playmaker I could have also gone for this one, which is like the play shot uh, kind of pie chart. Uh, but at 6-7, it's going to be hard to get this built to speed boost at 6-7. So we will go with a pure playmaker uh, pie chart. I think this is perfect for Luka Doncic. The, the pie chart can, uh, can speed boost really, really well. Uh, but not only that, he can shoot consistently. At least I'm hoping that he'll be able to shoot consistently. And um, uh, we have all the playmaking badges, which is very fitting for Luka Doncic because he's an insane playmaker and he still gets decent defense. I mean, Luka Doncic isn't the greatest defender, 
Uh, he's a good finisher around the rim and will have some good finishing stats. He isn't the greatest defender, but he can hold his own. So, you know, I, I really think that this build is very fitting for, 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 for Luka Doncic. All right, so chat. Uh, chat and YouTube, we will start making the build right now. So one thing that I find really, really important uh, is to uh, get this driving layup and driving dunk up. You need to be able to finish in the paint. I feel like the finishing, at least from what I've seen in the prelude, uh, has been pretty good. And uh, being at 6'7", probably playing against, you know, 6'2", six, 6'3", six, play shots, uh, we will hopefully be able to dominate in the paint if we're isoing and if we're playing in the pick and roll situation. Um, and, and we somehow have a drive and my center's popping and all that. You know, it will be important to be able to finish consistently in the paint. So I think that at least these two have to be upgraded. From what I've seen, close shots aren't as overpowered as before, but we'll get to that if you have some extra upgrades. Anyways, get to the shooting, mid-range, three-pointer have to be maxed. On every single build, um, I think that the mid-range and the three-pointer should be maxed, except for maybe like inside centers and stuff like that. But I think that these, sh these two should definitely be maxed. Yo, Mike is in the chat, man. Yo, YouTube, if y'all don't know, man, Mike is a big, big Luka Doncic fan. I'm really, really happy that he's in here because he's going to help us with the build. Anyways, chat. What I'm feeling is that we will we will do this for uh, for the defense. And I think that the build should look like this. So basically what we got here is excellent playmaking, excellent shooting, uh, good enough finishing stats because, you know, Luka Doncic, he, dude, he would, that spin move of his, man, where he, where he attacks left and spins back to the right, he, he was catching the Clippers off guard with that move the whole game. So I feel like, you know, he can dunk pretty well. He can finish pretty well on the rim. So, you know, the build still showcases that. Uh, he has the consistent three-point shooter with a 75, which is perfectly fine in my opinion for Luka Doncic. Um, the defensive rebound is there. You know, he did get 17 rebounds. So the defensive rebound is there. The defense, 75, I think is pretty good for Luka Doncic. Um, and the speed is maybe a bit high because he's not the most athletic guy in the NBA. But, you know, you know, it is what it is, man. A good speed is always good for speed boosting and stuff like that. And the speed will go down once we bring it up to 6.7. The vertical isn't even that bad. Like a 69 vertical will be able to do to do quite a lot of things with that. All right, so in my opinion, for body shape, uh, he definitely isn't compact. Like he doesn't have these veins and shit running out his arms. Um, Burly is maybe a bit too big, uh, but I'm thinking maybe either so solid, so I think solid, I think solid is, is, is Luca is Luca's thing. Height, 6'7", that's how tall Luca is. Uh, we do get an 85 ball control with this, boys, so, you know, we'll be able to speed boost eventually. The block goes up, the, the only thing that's a little bit bad is that the defense and stuff goes down, and the layup also goes down, but we will, you know edit that eventually as y'all see the 89 speed and 86 acceleration is still pretty damn good so um so yeah we'll, we'll continue with this now here is the thing that i found challenging because luca's a luca's a big boy luca's 230 he's 230 pounds but you know he, we're making a point guard build chat and as accurate I, as i enjoy you know making my builds like i enjoy you know, when I make my videos, I try to make them as accurately as possible. Like y'all see in the Charles Barkley builds, man. I put the little hairstyle. I put the signature uh, moves. I put all that. Uh, I put the weight up. But come on, are we really going to make a 225-pound point guard? I mean, if we put him at 180, I mean, this just looks wonderful, doesn't it? Like, he is a big guy. But, you know, at the same time, we're trying to make a build that, you know, can be good in 2k and you know a 230 pound point guard you know with the 87 uh speed i think that 90 speed and that 80 layup uh might be might be a bit better i'm thinking maybe maybe we go for uh this i think maybe we go for 187 pounds and anyways let me continue so for wingspan we're definitely going with minimum just to get the 86 ball control that's how it's gonna be um it's gonna help us with the three-pointer and you know with the defense uh with the defense it goes down a little bit but the fact that we're six uh, six seven i think we'll just be perfectly fine so we're gonna go with that and then for takeover now this is this is where um this is what i'm uh, i'm hesitating on between playmaker and sock rating like i know ah uh, shit because like 
Okay, here's what I'm here's what I'm gonna say though. All right, I think Luka Doncic is more of a playmaker than a shot creator. But what? But when the man is in his bag, he be shooting step back game winners. So you know we might as well go for shot creator, right, Mike? Right, Mike? Right? Yes? No? Maybe? You know? Cause like, so YouTube, I feel like Luka Doncic is a better playmaker than shot creator. But when he when he is hot, when he is in his bag, when he is scorching hot like it was in that last game, his step back his step back is lethal, man. And I think that element of his game is going to be um, displayed way better with the shot creating take than with the playmaking take. So I think I'm gonna go shot creator for this one. I'm, I think I'm gonna go shot creator for this one. And uh, I guess I guess I guess we'll play some. We'll, we'll, that gives us a playmaker that compares to Jamal Murray, John Wall, and D'Angelo Russell. And so I don't think I don't think that those are bad comparisons. Of course, if, we, if it would have said um, shades of Luka Doncic, that would have been crazy. But hey, I think we're gonna go with that. I'm, I'm gonna show you guys the badge layout. So what I think I should go with. Um, I'm thinking. Um, I'm thinking Range Extender Gold for sure. Green Machine Silver. Hot Zone Hunter Gold. I think these these are must must have badges. Let's go Volume Shooter Silver. I'm thinking Dead Eye Silver. I'm thinking maybe a little Corner Specialist and a Difficult Shots, or maybe go like this and then Hot Start. I'm thinking I might go with this chat. I think I might go with this. That. Now for playmaking, dude. This is where we go brazy. This is where we go brazy, boys. This is where we go crazy. Definitely Space Creator, because with the shot creating takeover, you know we're gonna be able to do a lot of Space Creators. Hall of Fame Unpluckable beautiful hall of fame floor general uh, um now what am i thinking bailout hall of fame and needle threader yeah needle threader needle threader will be good needle threader will be good all right so then for defensive badges i'm thinking clamps gold intimidator silver rim protector and chase down uh, i think you know if it was like the real luca build we'd have some more defense and we'd have a rebound chaser you know what i'm saying uh because you know he's a great rebounder but i think for like park scenarios this is what we should be using uh and then for finishing i'm thinking maybe relentless relentless i think we'll just go with that all right so um I appreciate y'all coming through for the video, man. That's going to wrap up the YouTube video on the Luka Doncic build. Uh, if y'all are new to the uh, new to the channel, don't forget to drop that uh, like and drop a sub. Uh, we are going to go crazy all of 2K21, so uh, just stay tuned for that. Uh, I love y'all boys. As always, stay cool, man. Peace. She just hit my phone. She said, Tucker, you a winner. I go home, then I turn her to a sinner, yeah I just got a check, I ate lobster for dinner She like my stuff, she tryna turn me to a nigga I just woke up, now they say that I'm a star I just wanna bone, oh my god Drive off the walk, he just caught a DOI